Close your eyes and focus on your breath. All the way in, all the way out. We focus on the breath because it's right here. It's always right next to the mind. As long as you're alive, it's going to be right here. And you're always going to need something ready at hand when things come up that disturb the mind. As the body gets older, as it weakens, it gets more and more out of control. It starts thinking ahead and all it can see is death, Ill illness. So all too often it just goes running back to the past without taking care of business here in the present moment. The business here, of course, is that the mind is always making choices about what to think about, what to say, what to do. And if a bad choice is being made, you want to be able to pull out. Because it's all too easy to get sucked into these little worlds that the mind creates. And our mind is usually like someone standing at the edge of a road. Somebody drives up in a car, says, hop in, you hop in. And only then do you ask, well, where are you taking me? Where are we going? If we lived our lives like that, we'd be dead long ago. But the mind just jumps into thoughts and it's lucky it doesn't get more mangled than it is. The reason we jump into the car is because standing on the side of the road is not a really good place to be. So what you want to give yourself is a little shelter like they have in Thailand. That intersection sometimes you'll see a little place with a roof and some benches where people can sit and be comfortable. And they're in no hurry to go anywhere. If someone comes by and says, hey, come along with us, you can say, where are you going? If they say someplace that's not all that interesting, you say, well, I'm pretty happy right here. So you want a place of comfort, you want a place of ease, a place where you feel like you really belong right here, which is why we work with the breath. Make it longer, make it shorter. See what kind of breathing feels good for the body right now. When you're getting tired, what kind of breathing is energizing? <coughs> when you're feeling nervous and tense, what kind of breath is soothing? It's like having a little medicine kit right with you, right next to you. Anything comes up and you've got the medicine you need to cure whatever the problem is in the body and many of the problems in the mind. So get used to being right here. Be on familiar terms with your breath. After all, it is the energy of life. And if you're not in good terms with it, it's going to be difficult to find anything you're going to be on good terms with. So learn to be comfortable right here. Make it a game to see how long you can stay here and with a sense of well-being. And add that to your repertoire. So when someone comes driving up, you're not immediately attracted by the fact that the car looks pretty or whatever. You want to go, where is this going? If it's going someplace you don't want to go, you say, no thanks. And you can stay right here with that sense of ease. And that helps prevent a lot of trouble that you could otherwise create for yourself. <laughs>